I could revive Priscilla in this case. Can't revive Shani. Can't revive Bloody Baron. I can revive Cantarella. That is an option. Eh, so many options. Thank not me. Thank Melitale. Okay. I'll revive Cantarella. No one can hide from me. Do not want that card. Maybe I should have saved the decoy. That was another option there. Going to play the Iris. And get it killed as soon as I can get something onto their side of the board. Praise be to the great sun! It's good to know that that's I there. Am sadness. We're gonna save our leader ability for his gold card over there. <laughs> I am sadness. Yes, you are. <laughs> Alba! More card advantage. Great. Uh, it's going to do six damage. The North, Tamaria. I guarantee the damage on that, so let's play that. Let's see what our last opponent's last Notice. card is. Notice! All roads lead to Nilfgaard! Alright, let's see the fireworks show. Now. Boom! Boom! And boom! Though I am curious what will happen. Uh, what will I get? Mahakam wasn't built in a day. Yes, I lose some of my units, but they lose a bunch of theirs. I like the way you die. Hugh. No! Wow. God damn it. <laughs> uh. Lie still. Well, I won. Not yet so recovered. I don't really worry. I'm not really worried. I win. But one of those situations where there's not much I can do. I'm assuming my opponent's going to clear as much off the board as possible, and then just I'm gonna have to hope my the remainder of my cards can. Okay. See what they do. They're definitely gonna get rid of a lot of power off my board. I'm gonna be left with 19 points. Uh oh, trouble approaches. Yeah, he wins. Oh, yes. He loses one of his units. I gotta keep my five power unit. He made a mistake there. Saved me some power. The... Don't make me laugh. Oh, we tie. Oh no. <sighs> plus two. At plus two. I could actually decoy this, but not yet. Resistance is futile. Then he has a Kahir, and that's what he's playing around. 
Is he gonna clear skies? That's fine. It's not a unit, so its strength is relative. Pretty good for me. So, is he gonna have a Geralt Igni on me? Is he gonna... What is he gonna play? I'm impressed. So... We're gonna play this immediately. Because this card's revealed in our hands. Okay. Well, this gives us a good opportunity to bounce that. Over to... Uh, this line. We want to have more units on this melee rope for our old spear tip. We know he has at least two Order melee triumph. units. It must triumph. Okay. We're going to place this here. So when he plays the Wild Hunt Rider, which he will eventually, it'll just buff my... Uh, I warned you. It'll just buff my melee row. At least, oh man, I really wanted him to play more cards. Uh, whatever. Did you insist? Modern Freire is patient, but she brooks no insult. You're good, real good. Interesting. Well, I'm protected from Scorch, but not from Geralt Igni. So what? Should I pound it into a poker? You can't pass, because if he passes, I will just. I have no mercy for your kind! That was actually pretty good. Well. Step careful there. The more cards he plays, the better. I want him to kill my guy if possible, because then I can revive it. It won't buff itself anymore now that Philippa's here. Which is unfortunate. Man, I'm, I want to miss. Wow, that was really strong. There's nothing I can revive to deal with this. You can't copy doo doo, which is a mistake on his part. Man, but that was a really good use of doo doo in the adrenaline rush. Can't use his leader ability on anything. Okay, we're gonna get our Priestess of Freya. What do you need? We're gonna get our three Queen Star. <laughs> You're good. Real good. Onward! Attack! Billion barrels are burning pitch. Make them uneven. But with one unit in the front. Hey, we win. Oh, that was not easy. Be doing this till five o'clock, but I need to make sure that everything's working. Okay. How do we want to handle this? The goddess protect you from all evil. Crack and eat me ghoulies. Looky here. May Modern Freya watch us and keep us. Hey. The goddess protect you from all evil. Greetings. Want to look over our stock?
suppose. And the end. So these units will be protected from Harold's ability because it'll only buff them. Damn it! For him to hit them. And I, need your I want him to use his leader ability. Yes. Yes. Beautiful. <laughs> Countered you, Harold. Countered you. Crowns. Come on, quick now. Okay. Just careful there. What's his last card? Does he have a way to kill my thingy above? Maybe he has a swipe. A swipe would be good. But if he uses swipe, I have different things I can do. Uh, I win! I win! First time. Yeah, I I don't think because Saris's strength is so low. Sometimes you just don't have enough revive cards to get both Saris and the Queen's Guard out, and you're also super vulnerable to weather effects. That's why I don't always play. Yes, but that game gave me. Yes, I know. Unfortunately, uh, that game gave me a really cool idea with Champions of Champions. Deck builder. It's. So you guys know how they remove doubling effects? There's still one card that doubles the strength of things on the board. Oh. Uh, so we're gonna make that deck right now. It's gonna be amazing. Obviously, it involves wounding a little bit. So we're gonna go with Skellige and we're gonna go with Croc on Crate. Oh, this will be, this will be wondrous. Yes. I'm so happy. I'm so happy I found this strategy. Silver. We're going to get to our silvers first because those are the important ones. We're going to need to have these two, obviously. We're going to need that. We're going to need this. We're going to need this. What else do we want? We're going to want that. Uh... Uh, trying to think of other things I want. Okay, we got all our silvers. I think. Now let's get rid of decoy. Silvers. We want Donner on Hindra. Yeah. That'll mess up their champion of champions. And we need a gold. We want more card advantage cards. Card advantage is best. It lengthens the length, uh, time of the game. We need to dig through our deck. Since we're prolonging matches, do we want to use Yennefer uh, or not? So many options. Okay. Silvers. Bronze. So here's the most important card in this particular deck. It's going to be the Warcry. Going to go with two of them, not three. I'm going to put one of those. We're going to need clear weathers. And we're going to need a Blizzard Potion in here. Yeah, Compi is too situational and your opponent can just pass. It's hard. Uh, and they remove the ability to steal Hemdall from the graveyard. Which I'm like, why? I loved Hemdall. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, okay. Uh, we're going to need more well, deck thing, don't we? Uh, 
should I drop cleaver or not? Uh, we want to. We just want to have the strategy, don't we? So, bronze. We do need a few other things in this deck to make it work, though. We need some adrenaline rushes. Okay, now we're gonna go to silvers. The one I need this to work. Because the goal here is to get these uh, champion of champions huge, as huge as possible. Uh, blue boy, Lugos. Well, if we're doing a wound deck, then we have to also have. You have Yennefer. Uh, I need a safe rover. Yeah. Silver. Uh, bronze. I know I want to have those in here, but it's not working out. Ooh. How am I going to wound them? Looking for other things. Alright, that'll work. That'll have to work. For this, all our sakes. Uh, I'm looking at all my cards. Trying to see if I have any other options. It, would have, it might have been better to copy Blue Boy Lugos. Instead of Champion of Champions, because Champion of Champions is fighting itself right now. Oh. Um. Let's give weather immunity to my champions of champions. This is such a weird game. I'm assuming my opponent's going to play. Yeah, I expected that. It's not a big deal. By the rates of Morhog. Got rid of his champion of champions. My Yennefer is still buffing all my stuff up. But the heart is not great. Oh man, if this goes on too long, I might not be able to kill anything with Yennefer. Who knows? I can always kill one of the uh, guys up there. I assume he's going to... No! Ah, that's so annoying that he did that. So, the main idea of this deck is to wound... That's fine with me. Um, I can't really do anything with my Geralt because I've used him late. So, let's see if he can get practically a bajillion points before the end of the round. My whale is doing a lot of work and is buffing up my Clan Tursok Axeman a ton. Okay. 
I win. Oh man, I, yeah, double whales is insane. It's ridiculous. Keep together. Okay. See what our opponent does. If he doesn't have an answer to the champion of champions, he doesn't have an answer to the champion of champions. Assassin. Again, it's gonna kinda of help me. I'm not bothered by Assassin yet. Okay, we're gonna keep going. By Hendo's axe! They'll not leave here alive. Okay. Oh, this is a tr this is like a dwarf trick around deck. What am I up against? Yeah. By the rates of Morhog. Okay. Well, well, that was cute. I'm gonna play this, For and then we're going to end with a war cry. Now imagine that he didn't have Scorch. My champion of champions would have been double strength. It would have gone from 34 to 68 or something like that. Oh, what's my favorite deck? Oh God. <laughs> 